Hi YouTube, Edward Tindall here, and Mikey Tindall, we just now got in, we're transferring animals around, we're going to finally take advantage of our chicken house again, once more, we had this hen, don't let no hens out of here baby, uh, we're setting up water, we got a water tray here, water, big five gallon water here, nice uh, set up, and then a 50 pound bag of food, we have all these chickens in here, we're going to let out, I haven't got a count on them, we started out with 25, and I don't know what we got now, but Mikey just got done catching all of those. We're going to try to get them, get them to go out of here if we can. Oh, there they go. Once they start going out of there, they go out of there. Come on. Hopefully. Hopefully. Um, this is our last Easter egg over there. Come on, chick, chick. Come on, chick, 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 chick. Come out once you get in something. We'll see if we can get him out of here. So we got one, two. <clears throat> three. Four. Five. It's safe to grab them by the back of their legs too and even hold them upside down there. Almost go dormant. Six, seven, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Don't let them out the door, son. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fourteen survived out of twenty-five because some of them got out. But that's fourteen chickens, so we have two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen egg boxes. For that many hens, and hopefully one of those babies over there will grow up to be a big, strong rooster, and be able to provide them the protection and the uh, stuff they need to be able to have, have babies and eggs and stuff. Yes, he's such a smart boy. Mike, you caught every one of them out of the chicken tractor himself because it's so cool. All right, come on, son. We'll get to the next thing. We'll get to the next thing. So we got that there with a the lock. We got concrete block, so nothing gets to them. And then we're going to extend this area out. We currently moved Miss Piggy. Y'all missed hearing her screaming, squeaking, squeal uh, on the trip up here. And uh, we've done a jam up, jelly tight, clean up job on all this stuff down here. I promise some of my viewers that we would do a garden update I've been trimming all this stuff up down here just giving myself more use of land until I turn into all of this looking like all of this um, since I'm feeding about six or seven families give or take one or two out of this one garden um, there's no sense in not feeding half of Alabama with this little square which I can do um, we got the other dog and the other dog Samson at Stony, and the new uh, yeah, it's re uh, did this whole pen a little bit. And we're gonna do some uh, hog pens and other stuff like that. I'll be showing y'all. Got different projects going. I got hog pens. I got to do a butchering station here and all that kind of stuff. Stainless steel tables, the water projects running. Hog pen and hog pen. Uh, we're gonna do some fish pens. When I was trimming up, I tried to be trim up but I don't want like this kind of stuff I don't like these trays they're very invasive from China I don't know exactly what it is but I don't like them and uh, then we have oak off of that big great oak tree there so I'm gonna leave that there and cut some more of them out don't leave in the comments below what you think let me know because I got a thousand about a thousand give or take fingerling catfish uh, Little bass about that long, mosquito fish, and brims about that wide. So, I'm fixing to have to either dig a really big pond or start sanctioning off concrete ponds that I built on a concrete block or whatever so I can get them out of here. Um, I've recently introduced some water lettuce, but I guess something has eaten out of here, maybe the horses. Um, this pond is usually just rolling. 
Uh, I don't like the way the water is. It smelled real fishy before because I guess they were spawning. Now they're not. So the water smells clean again and everything seems to be okay. It's a five year pond. They've been in that pool for five years. Different fish. So, you know, here's the rest of our little garden. Turkey. Oh, there goes one song. Um, the chicken tractor. This is cool too. Goats eat everything just about. See that banana he knocked down? I got the banana flower over there. He's eating up my Chinese uh, chestnut right there. He's eating all these plums. He's damaged this thing. Chicken tractor, we need to do some work on. That's where the chicken just came out of. He's trimmed up all this tree and all that stuff. Here's sugar cane we got growing here. And the horses, just between the horses or so, and evaporation, drink one of these a day. So, I gotta get that thing going. And then the goats and everything else, get that. Every day, what, baby? Need a solid grass in here. Huh. Here is sugar cane. Mm -hmm. Yep. The chicken is a jump stone. The chicken is a jump stone, people. It don't. It just don't get no better now. Look at this. Mmm. I wish I could smell. Well, watch my face. Oh, smell that. It smells like bananas, but with a mmm, mm, banana with a flowery smell to it. So banana flower. So you got a bunch, two, three, four, five, six bunches. Seven, eight, nine, ten. There's gonna be about 90 pounds of bananas here. This thing will touch the ground, or jelly bean will eat it. That's what a banana looks like. Growing in central bread. Alabama, Joe surviving 18 man. degree winters, friends. Thank Joe me for that. He been beating that tree up. Yep. He been beating it up like nobody business. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! This one had a banana on it, and he broke it off. Look at that. There goes the banana. really sad. Look at that. There goes the banana flower. There's going to be another banana flower on here. That's why, yep, that's why jelly beans going in the bottom garden here shortly. Thanks. Brownie horse town. Brownie's got to say Shadow, what are you doing? Are you eating my grass? Don't eat in my grass. Quit eating all my grass, you freeloader. <laughs> um, for those of y'all who said they were, horses were skinny and everything, that was an old video. If y'all are n newly watching my uh, videos now, <laughs> these are uh, growing big, growing big horses. They're getting better. This, this one's 22 years old, by the way, so he looks pretty damn good for a 22 year old. And then this one's about 21 and a half. She's a little bit younger, but they're uh, starting to look healthy again. They just had a real hard winter. You to update jelly bean? Yeah, we'll update jelly bean. Jelly bean! Jelly bean! Jelly bean! Jelly bean! There's jelly belly. Here's his ear. Still see through. Let me see if you can see through your ear, buddy. Oh, y'all can't get a very good view because he's moving. Like that. Hey, buddy. Hey, hey. See that ear where the, somebody else's dog's got him? Look at that sack. That's crazy. You could make a purse out of that for women. <laughs> what, are you, what are you laughing at? <laughs> well, they might like it. You never know. Everybody else that comes up here does selfies with, uh, with the uh, jelly balls. That's funny. We had our baby chickens in here because there was 10 of them, but for some reason, Gemstone ate the other ones. All right, friends, next time y'all see me, I'll be having a haircut and doing something else new. Thanks for tuning in. I love you guys. Peace, love, and happiness, and all that good shit. Like, subscribe, tell your friends, share my videos. Watch my older videos while you wait for new videos. Most of all, people, be yourself because yourself is cute.